What up guys, my name is Stanley Steen from Team Debru and today I am going to show you how to create your campaign with push traffic using Mega Push. So let's dive in. All right, so I am at the homepage of Mega Push, Mega P -U dot S H. And we are going to create a push campaign today, obviously. So first things first, you can still sign up for the Debrew Sweet Beta. That's right. So it's a brand new all around affiliate marketing platform with all the software and tools that you can possibly need for your affiliate marketing journey all in one place. And right now we have a beta test so you can join for free. Basically, just go to the link below in the description, sign up, and you'll get access for free. Now, let's dive into this push campaign with Mega Push. If you don't have an account with Mega Push yet, it's very easy to sign up. You basically click on sign up and you fill in your details right here, and easy as that. It couldn't get much easier. So, I already have an account, so I'm gonna sign in. There we go. All right, oh, I'm not a robot, just letting you know. Come on, bro, awesome. Let's sign in. Okay, there we go, awesome. All right, let's create a push campaign. I'm gonna create a new campaign. All right, all countries, well, maybe, maybe not. So we're just gonna select some countries. Okay, so what about the big five? United Kingdom, United States, Australia, New Zealand, and Canada. All right, cool. So we have five countries. We are going to run this on mobile and we want to paste a link. This is the test link they provide. So I'm just going to run with that for now. If that works, I think so. Okay, so we need a title maximum of 30 characters and a message with a max of 45. Then we need an image and an icon, a campaign name, obviously, but we'll just call this um, five geo weight loss for example whatever okay the title losing weight has never been I'm not gonna make it losing weight without without whoops without the gym. Perfect, that fits. Uh, burn your belly fat without expensive gym. Mem that's not gonna fit. Burn your belly fat without expensive gym. Burn your belly fat with one simple trick. Awesome. So yeah, an icon and an image. So let's open up Canva so that we can correctly crop our images that we're gonna need. So we're gonna create a design. 192 by 192 are the dimensions for the icon. And for the image, it's 492 by 328. 492 by 328. All right. Let's start with the icon. So what should we do? Maybe a healthy apple. Healthy apple. What is it called? Drawing? Illustration. 
Living apple? No, it doesn't need to be a living apple, thank you. Alright. What kind of results do we get? I don't want to use this. Watermarks everywhere, by the way. Ooh, I like this, but watermarks. There we go. What else do we have? This is pretty cool. Looks like apple though, look at that. This is dope. Plain, but dope. Ooh. I want something like this. Is this watermark free? This is watermark free, awesome. That is one of the best icons I have found in a long time. Did it download? No, it did not download. Save image. There we go, now it's working. Let's drop it into Canva and drop it in here. And it automatically crops the way I want it to be. So we are going to download that and it's downloading. So we can close this tab and we can go back to Mega Push to upload our icon. Awesome. That looks dope. That is a good start. Now we need a, what do they call it? Just image. We need an image. So maybe we do it before and after for this one. Why not? Before and after weight loss drastic. See what kind of results we get. <clears throat> so this is Jonah Hill, right? So we wouldn't use that. But this looks pretty extreme, but I don't see any reference that suggests this is the right person. So you always want some sort of reference. Here I do see the reference. It's the clothing that suggests it. The glasses, which are not exactly the same, but let's see if we can find some more. Dimensions are off, but I like the picture. Nope. What else? What else do we have? All right. All right. Alrighty. So these aren't very drastic to me. Like I'm looking at a lot of these pictures and I'm like, you're not even fat on the before picture. Like the fuck. This is a good one. I don't really see the reference of it being the same person. That's a good one, but the quality is bad and the dimensions are off, so we're not going to use it. Let's see more. No reference that it's the same person, so you want to look for something like same clothes or same room or something like that that really suggests this is the same person, right? Very important because this might be the same person, but nothing in there really suggests it. So that's what we want to create. Let's see. Do we have something else? So this would be good if she was wearing the super woman, super thing outfit in the after picture as well. But unfortunately, she's not, which makes me want to use something else. So let's see what else we have. Might work, might work. Why is it twice the same picture? I don't get that. Like, why, why would you? Why would you? Why would you? For real. Okay, okay. Uh, what about this? So once again, no reference, right? This is clearly the same person, but I want it to be clearer that it really is. So I am going to continue looking. Maybe before after keto, maybe we'll get some 
different results. Well, here it's not the same clothes. It's almost the same clothes. But it suggests more that it's the same person, even though they look less like each other. Since she has blonde hair and brunette hair. So... Hmm, too bad if the watermarks would have been a good picture. What else do we have? Let's see, let's see. You can take your time picking these pictures because you want to pick the right ones. These are the most important pictures of your creatives. So pick them right. Take your time. Pick the right image. Right? Hmm, female 30 day keto diet results. Sure. These are not drastic enough. One month, but it's the same. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. Huge weight loss before and after. Female. Because I think that the majority of the audience that we want to reach is going to be female audience. So that's why I want a female before and after picture. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. She's wearing the, she's not wearing the same clothes, but almost. But it looks like the same person to me. That's good enough. Good enough. Let's drop it into Canva and then Canva can crop it however he wants it. And I like it. I like the way they do it. So we could even do something like this if we want to. Make it red. Make it pop. Pop, pop. There we go. Download that. And then we are going to drop it into mega push let's go awesome apply cool okay so cpc three cents sure that's fine with me block list nope i'm not going to do that but we are going to turn up android 4 for this one Okay, and let's get a push example, allow that. And oh, you won't see it because it's on the other side of my screen, but it looks pretty cool. It basically, it just looks like this, right? So awesome, we've created a campaign with Mega Push for a weight loss offer. So you can do the same thing, just follow my lead and rewind this video if you want some more instructions on how to set everything up, but it's pretty straightforward. So that's going to be it for this one. Don't forget to check out the Deborah's Sweet Beta, which you can still join for free. And I will catch you next time. Peace out.